All right, put my glasses on to go in here because it's bright. This is the new Canagro light. It's looking pretty sharp. Nice and solid construction. Dual fans on the top. On off switches up in the top here. And yeah, I like it. It's a full spectrum. It's got UV, ultraviolet. And I'm just turning the fan there so we can, like, you can hear me a little better. And yeah, the plants seem to be loving it so far. Um, I hang them up quite high. There's about six inches of space before the roof of the grow tent here. And there's a lot of plants hanging on the back here. So these are all different Hoya species and cuttings. Down below is a few Venus flytraps as well and some sundews. And yeah, they're loving it. The reds stay nice and red. Uh, the colors on camera look really good as well. And it seems to be pretty good at about, let's see, two feet. We'll say about here where my hand is. I was in here last night with the um, light meter. There's about 1,600 candles at about two feet. And so plenty of light for these guys. Nothing to, um, to worry about there. Hoyas are sort of a medium light plant anyways. Um, if you were growing something directly below it that took high light, I would probably put it um, within 18 inches or so of the, the light itself. Runs really quiet. I barely hear the fans. There's um, just a little bit of air movement on the fans. Not a ton. I think that's why they're, they're so nice and quiet. It's a really thin light unit too. Very, um, very nice. Um, good light um, dispersion as well. Hits everywhere in the, the grow chamber. You can kind of see it reflecting off everything. So yeah, I am really happy with it so far and we'll um, give it a go.